One of our most exciting programs is our yo-yo program. We have lots of different shapes and sizes and um, you'll just have a great time working with these. We first came out with the circles and we currently have five different sizes. We have extra small, small, large, extra large, and jumbo. This is our large right here. We have a heart which is in two sizes, large and small, and a flower, a shamrock, a shamrock and a butterfly, and all of those come in two sizes, large and small. Our newest one is our oval shape, and we'll be showing you how to work with that in just a minute. No matter which template you use, they're all done in the same way. We have a disc and a plate. There's a shiny side and a dull side. On the uh, circle, because it's round, you have to have a point where that you bring these, uh, the circle and the plate together. On the disc, we have a little bump here, and on the dull side of the plate, we have a line. And you're going to put the ridge and the line, match those up together. First, we need to get our fabric in there as well. What you want to remember to do is that the disc goes so that you can see the right side of the fabric through the hole. So it would be just like this. Flip it over, find your ridge, and look for your line. There's the ridge, there's the line, we're good to go. And snap that in. There's no pre-cutting of your fabric, which makes this really nice. But at this point, we're going to trim out our fabric right around the outside edge of the template. It's nice because you can take the different size of circles and work with your scraps and make yo-yos out of, out of scrap. Okay, once that's done, we're going to want to do our running stitch. We have needle and thread with a knot in the bottom at the end. And I want to direct your eye to the fact that there's a little place on here that looks like a little smiley face open between here and it has a little um, groove that you're going to come in and out of. So we're going to find a spot and with our finger on the back we're going to hold this extra fabric which is our hem. So as we do our running stitch we're coming up from the back on the right side of the smiley face and down the left. This is your running stitch and hem all at the same time. Now our heart and our oval and our circle have only running stitches on the outside edge. On the heart, the only difference is that right here you're going to make a little clip into the center. I'm going to show you how to separate this and uh, pull up on the gathers. They all work the same way as well. You're just going to separate the plate from the disc and pull the fabric off the plate. Now you're ready to pull up the gathers. On the oval, there are two long stitch areas right here on each of the four corners, and those produce a big pleat that needs to go to the back, it needs to drop back into the uh, wrong side of the oval. So you want to keep your eye on those, and I'm gently pushing around as I'm gathering up to keep the shape. And sometimes those gathers want to come to the top, so you just want to make sure that they're all tidy down behind. The next thing is to make sure that the center is in the center of your oval. And this is a great tip. If you want your center to look nice and even, just pick up the tip of each of the pleats with your needle all the way around the circle and draw up. And as you do this, it closes up the circle 
and makes it nice and tidy. So we'll draw those up all nice and even. The beauty of this template is all of your gathering stitches are as even as can be. Now the ones that are the flower and the shamrock and butterfly not only have the stitching on the outside, but they also have stitching on the inside. You can see it a little bit better on the flower. The unique part of the flower is that in this particular one, you can have a contrasting color in the center by putting in another piece of fabric right side up. And what you get when you do that is the contrasting center of the flower. It's really very much fun. All right. On the butterfly, the shamrock, and the flower, you're going to stitch around on the inside. It's important that you're not be to the inside and that you come around and that you end on the opposite side where you began. Again, stitching is all done on the outside as well as the inside. To bring your needle to the front. Take your plate out and lift your thread out. Now you can see that we've got a start and an end. What we're going to do is draw up on both of those. And the reason why they have a center stitch area is because it brings the shaping of the butterfly um, more clearly. When you pull that up, you're going to tie this off. And you want to make sure that the excess fabric is to the inside or the wrong side. That would be the outside. When that's done and you tie that off, you can just clip these and then pull up on your outside gathers. And as I do that, <coughs> I'm actually putting my hand inside and letting it gather around my fingers, working those hems to the back. You can begin to see the butterfly shape happening. It's like magic. And again, once you have this all done where you bring the gathers to the center, you're going to pick up the tips and make a nice clean center. So there's our butterfly. We're going to do a, pick up our um, pleats around the center and tighten it up. The fun thing about the butterfly is that you can take ribbon and wrap, wrap it, or even uh, this is a chenille, chenille a stick, and beads, and do some really interesting uh, embellishments on this as well as using little wires or stamen for the antenna. On the circle yo-yos, we have all the different sizes created to make this beautiful little Christmas tree. So you can take them and string them and make a long time, or frequently we've made animals out of these, but this is our star of the show, the little Christmas tree. We have a project sheet on this one. Here's an example of one of our smaller circles on a little checkbook cover. Gives it nice elegance. And this is what you can do when you get all of them put together. You can make a wonderful collage of a variety of different yo-yos. Here's your heart, small heart. There's a large heart, different flowers, combinations. You can just have a lot of great fun.